<laughs> oh, I gotta get that. Well, she ordered her orange juice. Hold on, y'all. First class mentality. I gotta tell y'all about that experience, but I'm not gonna do it now. We gotta wait to tell y'all. Uh, good morning. I love you guys. <laughs> I got, so, I got so much to tell y'all. We might pop up all day today. Hold on, y'all. Y'all gotta watch that and order her drink. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, y'all. Tomato juice? You want it with ice? No ice. Okay. Strong? No ice. You can go right past me. Can I get you something? Yes, ma'am. Could I have orange juice with the straw, please? No Chilled. ice. Chilled. Yes, chilled. No straw. No, with the straw. I mean, with no the straw. Eye. No ice. Okay, I got you. Thank you. Strong. <laughs> Brittany said with a straw. Okay. She knows she says straw. <laughs> Brittany, we had a curtain on the last no, plane. Did. Yes, we did. Um, Brittany said, y'all, we got a curtain. <laughs> no hey, Cash. So, y'all, I think I got a minute. So, like on a serious note, how y'all doing this morning? So, check this out. When we got to the airport, uh, you know, our tickets uh, say premium, because that's what they say when you first class, right? So we got ready to go in the line, and we got stopped like we was in the wrong line. This guy said, whoa, wait a minute, let me see your tickets. And so, like, literally, like, he stopped us. Now, I've been in a lot of airports lately, and I see people just walk right up, and nobody bothers them. So, you know, like, if you have regular boarding, you have to go through this long snake of a line, right? But if you have priority boarding, you just walk straight up, and they let you cut in front of the other people who have the regular tickets. Well, when we walked straight up, we got stopped. Like we went in the wrong line. And then we were just lined up to get on the plane. And somebody came to us and said, is this the premium line? Like we in the wrong line. <laughs> and he gonna say, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so with that being said, it's the truth, like sad but true. I think people have their, some people have their own ideas of what someone who sits in first class is supposed to look like. But one thing about those in the kingdom of God, we're all first class. Yeah. So with that being said, we're headed to Atlanta and we just wanted to let you guys know, like, I don't know, today I was just able to experience something that I don't normally experience. Maybe because I normally don't ride first class. But it's, it's people stereotype you and decide what you're supposed to look like if you're in first class. Not everybody, just immature people, small minded people who try to stereotype you and decide what first class is supposed to look like. Aren't you glad to belong to the kingdom of God where everybody's first class? I am. So, it's been a good weekend. Hey, Kathy, you've been on my mind. We need to do lunch. But, um, I'm going to talk to y'all some more this evening. But it's true. Like, and it didn't just come from white people. No, 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 no. It, no, we got stopped by a black guy who asked us, who basically, you know, gave the presumption that we were in the wrong, the wrong line. So I'm, I don't mean like it's just one race that's doing it. I think people just have in their minds what you're supposed to look like to be premium. So, but we'll talk about it more um, once we get home. But let me just tell you one more thing. Somebody, one of the warrior sisters, um, I'm going to wait till finish talking. Hold on a second. That's right. Meredith says we're all first class. All other electronic devices must be in airplane mode. That's right. Sissy said we're first class with our Lord. That's right. Let me say this. A warrior sister emailed us and donated her Delta Sky Miles to us. She said to make sure we continue to ride first class. Isn't that awesome? 
So yeah, I was saying somebody emailed us this morning and donated us her sky mile. She said we want to make sure you guys continue to ride first class. You guys are amazing. Like we didn't look for that, we didn't ask for that, but you guys did it. I love you guys so much. So we'll be home soon. We have a lot of work to do when we get home. So no worries there. We'll let you know when we get home, and I'll tell you more about our adventure. <laughs> it's been good, but it's also been eye opening just to see how people look at you and judge you. You know, but I love you guys so much. You have a great day. And we'll let you know when we land. Yeah, we're going to talk more about it because I want to talk more about it. Y'all are so precious. I love y'all so much. It's been a good weekend, a really good weekend. So we'll talk to y'all soon, okay? Pray for us. Some of you guys I'll see this weekend. How yes. exciting is that? <laughs> <laughs> the favor of God is first class. Yes. But for somebody to say, I'm going to give you my sky miles. God told me to. It's like... I would do exceedingly and abundantly more than you can ask or imagine. I don't even know what to say <coughs> other than thank you. I don't know what else to say. So I'll tell you guys when we land, okay? Have a great You got to go to church? Get on out the door now. Don't be late. Right. Love y'all. And pay your tithes. Mm. <laughs> bye. Smoke, you want to say something? Hold on. You want that chilled? <laughs> All right. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Love you.